Hi, this video is from interview.com. Interview.com is a job portal. If you're looking for a job, you can post your resume with us. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to install Derby plugin in Eclipse. There are seven easy steps you can install Derby plugin in Eclipse. Step one: download following jars. Derby core plugin, Derby UI plugin, and these are the links to download these two plugins. If you want the latest version. You can check in the internet to get the latest version. This is 10.5. If you want the latest version, you can check in the internet. So, the second step is once you downloaded, once you downloaded uh, these two zip files, extract it and keep it in a keep it in a directory. And you have to copy the extracted directories to wherever you installed your Eclipse. I have installed in this directory, so I will be copying the directories to this plugins folder okay so in eclipse select window show view other and you can see data management so in the data management click data source explorer okay and right click on the database connection and say new click new since we are going to configure derby you have to select derby and say next in the next window you have to give the new driver definition click this new driver definition option so the moment you click it you will be getting another window you should ensure that derby embedded jdbc driver 10.2 is clicked then click the next tab jar list tab just now you copied three directories to the plugins folder in your eclipse okay out of that one directory or org apache derby core this directory will have the derby.jar so we should inform where is this derby.jar to eclipse this is how you can inform the, just add this jar file here then click ok now you are ready with your plugin you can create your database with by giving sample database name and username and password The moment you click the disk connection, it will check the connection. So I've already created a plugin here. I've already installed the plugin and I've already created one table for demo purpose. Okay. So this is my employee table and test table. So I have just executed one query so that just want to show how after the installation of the Derby plugin how it works. So I have already installed, I have followed all these steps okay, and I got this Derby plugin installed and I have already created a database name interview. Two tables I have created for demo purpose I am executing this query okay. and if you want to execute a query you have to right click you have to open this open SQL scrapbook then you will be getting a SQL scrapbook like this you can execute you can write the query any query any query you want and you can execute like this okay so these are the seven steps to install Derby plugin in your Eclipse hope these steps are useful thank you and all the best